Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new video. I am your host, Ezbright Rabbit. So today we have a brand new chapter being chapter 5 of Super Dragon Ball Heroes Meet Your Mission. I am really excited to cover it, it came out yesterday, but I just got the time to see it today and that's what we're gonna do in this video. If you like Super Dragon Ball Heroes, from the manga, the arcade, to the anime, and I don't know, maybe you wanna see me play some other Dragon Ball games, Feel free to subscribe and ring the bell to not miss anything. Without further ado, let's jump straight into today's chapter. For the sake of your friends, push past your limits. So I think it's going to be Vegeta's chapter. Oh, I mean, to be frank, a lot of the times the cover doesn't mean anything in terms of what's going to happen at chapter, but... <coughs> Okay, I mean, in the anime we got uh, Vegeta getting a big W, uh, which I reacted to if you guys want to check it out. It was a pretty alright episode. The mysteriously drifting invitation led to Ozoto's palace. The full picture will now be revealed. This must be Ozoto's palace. What is that? That was like a, a weird looking boba. <laughs> What the hell is that? Why is there so many spikes? I mean, I know he consumed logs. This is probably part of her power, but what the hell is this? Oh, there it is! Uh, I mean, we saw this shape in the CGI promotion, but the spikes, were they there? They feel new to me. But it looks really cool, actually. Oh, that's an eye! Ugh, that's weird looking. You have reached Miss Supreme Cow of Time. Welcome to my Ozoto Palace. Your companions have been gathered inside first. You don't get to see that? Okay. Ho oh, ho, now then. You shall enter too. Stay safe, everyone. So she gets inside, because in the CGI, like, oh no, Kronoa, it's safer if you stay outside. She went in, in the manga. Okay. I don't know about the arcade, because it takes a while to translate and I've been a bit busy. But this is alright, so she goes in. That's new. Oh, damn. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so, wow. Room 1, Xeno Trunks. So we're gonna see more what happens inside. This is what to expect from the manga. They basically go more into detail and depth of what happens and things and sneak peeks that the arcade and promotion at, uh, CGI didn't do. This palace has five rooms. The more divided Ozoto is, the weaker he becomes. You're toying with us with your weaker version, Ozoto. What's the point of all this? <laughs> You're all food for me, after all. I want to bring out more of your latent power to make it this good. Now, please, go further into the room. So, late, you're telling me Ozoto is a cat. He just likes to play with his food. Room 2, Zeno Vegeta, and we have the Ginyu... No, wait. This is the Turla squad. Uh, what's the name? Okay. Cr Crusher? Crusher Corp? I think it's the name. I don't remember. And too lazy to search. Cool, regardless. And he's in the Super Saiyan form. Super Saiyan form? Super Saiyan 4 form. Okay, nice. Because in CGI, we just saw them in their base form. Which is alright, but... Uh, you know, I... Uh, I like uh, Super Saiyan 4s. <laughs> I really like them a lot, so um, the more the better. Hey, this is boring. You're right, it's not very exciting. Allow me to provide you with a more suitable partner. Ew! What is that? That's gross looking. Oh, never mind, that's hot looking. <laughs> How did you go from this? Okay, okay, I guess you can see one of the hairs there. Oh my, I mean. Wait, who fought Turles? It was Goku. Goku fought Turles, but now it's Vegeta. Which... Wait, but it's Xeno Vegeta. But this is not the uh, the new quote-unquote Turles. It's the old Turles before his hair grown like L'Oreal Paris. Trust your hair to an invisible force. New formula L'Oreal Elmay. Because I'm worth it. Kakarot? No, that's Turles. I mean, don't you see his hotter bro? Of course it's Turles. <laughs> No, nah, I'm joking. I'm not here to diss Goku. They are both attractive. <laughs> that blow was much evident of the earlier Ozotos. Bon appetit! Uh, 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 nah, nah. Oh, it's Bojack! Oh, I'm, I'm dumb. That's Bojack. 
Room 3, Son, Son Goku Xeno. That's for sure, Bojack. Yeah, there you go. He looks so pretty. I, I like how he draws the Xenos and Super Saiyan Force. Wow, he's really putting his guts out. Well, damn. Oh, that's really nice. Ooh, nice blows. I cannot stop thinking about what happened to Vegeta. That was that was awful. It works indeed. I doubt we can go toe on toe with each other in our current state. I can't wait to see how strong you are now that you fully merged. Bro, I mean Vegeta is this not he's not been eaten. You know, he hasn't been eaten yet. I'm I am very sure of that. If Osoto had to show up to beat Zeno Goku, it's gonna happen the same to Vegeta. Ain't no way. They were like, they saying like, sick. <laughs> They're trying to scare us, but we know Vegeta is still alive, for sure. If he's not, I call it bullshit. This wonderful power is increasing further and further. Those in the other rooms are also ripping nicely. It's about time to eat. Nobody's going to get eaten by you. Thank you. So there you go. Vegeta is alive. I was like, bro, you don't pull me that. You pulled, you pulled an asshole move by eating hearts right in the first chapter, which is an atrocity. I don't want to see that again. <laughs> ho ho. The rest of them are also full of high spirits like you. Very soon they will be deliciously devoured by my split selves. Huh. I think you're underestimating them a little bit, aren't you? Vegeta in particular is someone you can handle. He's strong and I know his strength better than anyone. Oh, but in the manga, Zeno says that in the CGI, it's uh, Capsule Corp Goku. Okay, so this, this is indeed the Zenos. The cover did not mistaken. It is Zeno episode. I like this. Ah, there you go. I was like, bro, you don't, you don't do Vegeta like that. It's impossible. Against Starless, really? <laughs> There you go. Your ability makes you weaker the more you split, right? That means you're cutting corners, aren't you? You're fighting like an idiot. If you want to bring me down, you need to come at me with all your divisions fused together. Even so, that wouldn't be enough for me. Screw you, splitting bastard. There you go. I was gonna be like fucking complaining. There you go. Honestly, as expected, if it was something else, I would be throwing hands. <laughs> Is he suffering from damage? Back then, he regenerated right away, but I destroyed him. The more he fuses, the easier it is to stay and the more damage he takes. The fact that he doesn't regenerate right away currently. Is that evidence of that? <laughs> Boring. Oh, are we gonna have Trunks slice Osoto up <laughs> so it's easier to kill? That's a, that's an idea. Room four, Son Goku. <laughs> As expected. Room five, Vegeta. Let's add ten more to the merge. Ten more. Pycon. Oh, we saw an Amber. Pycon. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right. A fateful match. Okay, this was definitely better than a CGI. <laughs> I mean, in terms of uh, quality, yeah. But even in writing, this is so much better than CGI. I am actually quite pleasantly surprised. They pulled a similar thing that they did in the CGI of like, Oh, Vegeta is gonna be eaten right away, but then he, psych, he's not eaten, he's actually stronger. Haha, <laughs> did I get you? You, I mean, kinda? Uh, I mean, you got me confused. That's for sure. I got confused rather than like, oh, he got eaten. It's like, nah, it ain't no way. Because ever since I saw hearts being eaten in the first chapter, I, I cannot trust anyone. <laughs> I see and I assume that it is what it is. Even if it's bizarre, it is what it is. So I'm like assuming that whenever somebody is technically eaten, they are eaten. Because of what we saw in the past. Oh, but that's changing and hopefully it continues changing because I mean Osoto eating everything and leaving just um, you know, five <sighs> And Chrono got in Which is very interesting and I 
wonder if he's gonna be able to actually consume her. But either way, it's a very interesting chapter. So let me know what you guys thought about the chapter. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Uh, I think I did a 5 out of 10 on the CGI. This was probably a 7 out of 10. I really like this chapter and I don't know, I hope you liked it too. Thank you all so much for watching, especially my members who support my channel. If you want to support me monetarily a little bit, you can become a member. It really helps the channel a lot. With that being said, I hope to see you all on my next video, shorts or stream. So, stay tuned for that content, my friends.